Hi everyone, today we are looking at the connections. So you will probably tell me when you are watching this video that oh yeah, we know each uh, everything about the connection, etc. Um, I according to me, it's not it's a little bit false because I receive a lot of mail uh, in my mailbox or in Facebook or on in the website. Um, a lot of mail lot of mails um, that uh, people ask for uh, have some questions about uh, connection so this video is here and I take the moment to uh, exit this little this uh, great mixer the SVM mill because there is a lot of connection I think there is probably 99% of the connections directly on this mixer and we will see one or two connections you can have in the DJ part um, little exceptions but you can find it so we will talk about it in this video right now so first one the main connections in French we call it LCR but I think we call it uh, in English Cinch 2 so it's the main connection for DJs you can um, take it for the input output for CD players for um, multimedia player, phono, uh, turntable play, uh, turntable, um, record turntable. You can put it directly like that, the right, the left. If your turntable needs a ground screw, you can make it, uh, you can put it directly here with a little screw here. But there is some turntable who don't need this, so it's a choice you can see it directly on the connections of your turntable so LCA you can have it's very strange but you can have just one LCA but it's not a real LCA it's a LCA connection but it's not an analog connection it's a digital connection like this you will have the ASP diff uh, connections coaxial connections for uh, digital connections so you can have in input, you can have it on output. And you can, if you have maybe 50 centimeters or one meters between your mixer and your uh, CD player, you can use a LCA, normal LCA and split the left and the right and put it directly. But don't use this kind of cable, LCA cable, cinch cable, uh, for a digital connection if you have two or three or five uh, meters between your device and your mixer. So first LCA. Second connection the jack, the quarter jack. Um, they are very old because you had this uh, for um, operator during World War II who that are uh, putting these to make communication between people with a telephone or something like that. So it's very old connection, but still a good connection in today. You can have in mono or stereo. You can have in uh, symmetrical or on uh, balance or not balance, unbalanced. Um, you can have the defini definitions of symmetrical and symmetrical balance and balance with my other video um, which uh, we are telling you how to use your cable with your speakers so jack it can be so mono or stereo it can be in input for example for a mic or input here for um, combo jack xlr we will see xlr after or you can do it for an uh, output for example so jack you can have some adapters like that with uh, which is uh, female or female and you can put maybe if you have two little cables to one meter for example you can have two meters with that no problem after we have the XLR so it's the same as the jack you can have symmetrical or unsymmetrical so balance and balance you can have a marl and a female here they can be used uh, with an input or an output. Maybe for input, you can use it, you see here, with my combo jacks, jack XLR here. 
and for example a mic see here for example blah 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 and after you can choose to use it directly on a output like that and the um, third part is in output but it's not the same impedance cable but you can have um, co um, digital output AOS so you can put it directly here but it's uh, it's more engineers in the in a concert or something like that festival it's not the DJ who is plugging directly this so SEA jack XLR you can have a digital too SEA digital you can have also a hold very old connection but still connection today the MIDI connection here so you can have this kind of cables in and out and you plug it directly here it's a MIDI DIN it's called MIDI DIN you have five little things inside and you plug it like that so you can transfer uh, MIDI operation MIDI messages and MIDI clock if you have a, a BPM inside this uh, mixer you can output the MIDI clock the MIDI BPM directly for your uh, connection for a synthesizer or for a sequencer a sampler something like that so it's very cool oh just before I forgot but I see it now the jack connection let's put on replay you have a little one of course the little one uh, I don't know in English but you have the bigger one here the quarter I don't know it's 3.5 in France in, in, in French and if you have a mixer with this connection you can put it directly for your headphone for example but if you don't have a lot of headphone are chipped with this little connection and you can have the quarter one so jack you have of course this connection you will know oh, it's difficult to take the cable you have the usb port so USB can transfer information between two devices or it could be a key, a USB key, something like that. You can of course put it directly on your mixer and have a sound card to output all your sound in your computer directly on the mixer. Or you have this connection here to plug to your CD player for example, multimedia player with your USB key. So USB cable. After you will have uh, little connections, we will we are not seeing this with this mixing mode because there is no connection like that. But you will have a lot of time. This connection is the Ethernet communication RG45. Uh, it could be used for your box for internet at home. But of course, you can plug it directly on between your mixer and your box or your mixer and your. Uh, uh, CDG player, multimedia player, and this uh, cable can uh, allow you to have maybe, for example, the, the link part, the clock part, or to uh, transfer tracks between, uh, between players. So you can have a lot of cable like that in your setup. And to finish with, two connections that are not very known for uh, everybody but you know this directly with your TV for example is the HDMI you can plug it between your s DVD player and TV but you will use this cable if you output the video signal if you mix some video in your uh, software like uh, Viltrol, Serato, Recordbox and you can encounter this uh, connection a lot with your uh, DJ uh, work and to finish with the SDI connection you will encounter this not a lot but you have to uh, know know this so SDI is a video uh, audio video uh, connection it's not you have the connection here it's BNC but you have just to it's not the same connection but just to show you how to plug it if you have this connection you have just to push and turn it's BNC you can have the same thing 
for the oscilloscope where you were in school. So SDI um, is the same as FG, L, ADMI, HDMI, but it's more pro connection than the HDMI. So you know now all the details for the connections. If you have any questions, feel free to ask under the video on the website en.djstuff.fr or directly on Facebook if you want. Um, don't forget to watch everything, every tips on this page en.djstuff.fr slash tips t i p s. You have everything you have to know. Um, thank you for watching this one. See you next content. Take care, everybody. Bye bye.